and welcome back to Attractions Mayhem. Today we're here in Blackpool for the opening day of Blackpool Pleasure Beach 2024 season. I'm so looking forward to going on Icon. Um, such a, a brilliant ride and ghost train. Uh, I'm looking forward to going on Nickelodeon Streak and lots, lots more rides. Yeah, definitely. Blackpool Pleasure Beach is an absolutely amazing theme park. Just located just across from the promenade here in Blackpool. It's an amazing theme park, it is. isn't it, Mum? Yeah. And, um, yeah, we're so lucky to have it in the UK. Some amazing coasters like Icon as well, yeah. uh, Big Dipper, some rough coasters as well. Yeah. But, yeah, <laughs> and some really good dark rides as well, like Valhalla as well, yeah. and um, Alice in Wonderland, Ghost Train. Yeah. And, yeah, oh, and I just love opening days. Yeah. Just so magical opening days, aren't we, Mum? Yeah. Of any theme park as well, really. It's just amazing, isn't it? Can I just yeah. say, we're not... Um, annual pass holders this year no we so, are um, I'm booked online before we came and it was £35 uh, each you do save a lot more money if you book online uh, before you come yeah. uh, I think it would have been £50 if we'd have um, booked on the day so always uh, consult um, the website yeah, we made a decision to not get annual passes this year because no. we want to try some new theme parks yeah. here on Attractions Mayhem yeah, this do. year. So, um, yeah, um, we did make that decision. But, yeah, yeah we'll come to Pleasure Beach today for the opening day. But, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. We've got an also a new logo at Pleasure Beach. Yeah, Champion yeah. Home. It's now called Pleasure Beach Resort. Yeah. And, yeah, what do you think of the logo, Mum? I think they've done the same as Thought Park. Haven't yeah. They, where they can do it in different colours. Yeah, um, definitely. Uh, on different, whatever, yeah. you know, different Personally, bits. I'm not a massive fan. I love the old Pleasure Beach yeah, logo, but so. still, it was at least what it is, yeah, isn't it? it? Is. Hopefully, there's some new updates around the park, any yeah. new paints, any yeah. refurbishment. We'd, we'll we'd, show you all that yeah. in the vlog as well. We do know big, dig, uh, the big ones not are open today. Yeah, do we? unfortunately not, but um, yeah. And um, hopefully we'll have an amazing day here. We, at will. we know it's going to be busy, it's opening yeah. day, but it's just how it is at Pink Parks as well, isn't yeah. it, Mum? But yeah, can't wait to get back into Pleasure Beach. It's an amazing park. So let's start it off the 2024 Theme Park season here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Oh, here we go. The doors are open and we're going into Pleasure Beach for the 2024 season opening day. Are you ready, Mum? I'm really, really looking forward yeah, to this. Yeah, it's really busy. The, the Look at the crowd. The electric here. Yeah, it's so it is. Good. Yeah, definitely. With all the confetti that just came out, Amanda just opened it, didn't she? Yeah, yeah. And they have fireworks in the Not fireworks, well, confetti. Confetti and stuff. But yeah, see you inside. Oh yes, we are now in Blackpool Pleasure Beach for 2024. You excited, Mum? Oh, I'm so excited. Yeah, where are we heading first? Uh, Nickelodeon Street because um, there's only one train on there. It gets long queues. Yeah, definitely. Icon um, doesn't open till a little later, does it? It opens at 11. All right. Yeah. I'm not quite sure. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. We're never there first because it only runs one train. It gets really long queues, that. But yeah. Nice. Welcome to Pleasure Beach 2024. Oh, I've missed this. I miss this coaster so much. It's icon. Looking good. Look at this bit. Not too bad of a queue either yet. I haven't built one up yet for a bit. It's not too bad. Still testing it, aren't we, really? Yeah, can't wait to get back on icon.
yourself icon for the first ride of the 2024 season here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. What did you think of it, Bob? I love the double launches. It's got a little kick with that little uh, turn and then that big turn up there. I love yeah, it. Yeah, definitely. Really, really love yeah. it. Screw though, such really a smooth ride as well. Yeah, so remember if I can ride. go on it, it's so cool. Yeah, you. it's really good for the icon. I really yeah. love it. Mac rides, of course, though, it's amazing here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. And uh, yeah, it's built up a queue now, hasn't it? More from the queue there, uh, but yeah, it's queuing outside. So um, yeah, but yeah, loved it. Um, it's amazing icon. Also, you can get into if you want spinny seats there, um, yeah. but you do have to pay extra for them, of course. But yeah, it's absolutely amazing icon. I really do enjoy it. Yeah. Anyway, next we're just gonna head to Steeplechase next time. We're going for our next we'll ride. Yeah, but yeah. No, I think we'll head to oh, Steeplechase. Right, okay. But yeah, yeah, um, yeah we'll see steeple what we're Steeplechase. I've been on this for a while. Let's go racing. Right then, roll on Steeplechase for the next ride, eh, Mum? Yeah. Oh, look at this. It's not too bad. Yeah, it's an old ride, Steeplechase, isn't it, Mum? Yeah. You go on your own horse and like you race two other people on this, don't you? It's a unique ride, I think there's only one in the world. Yeah, we'll head on to Steeplechase now. Obviously, park hours today, 11, um, 10 to 5, I think. Yeah, 11, 11 or 5. 5, yeah. Well, we won, won the race on the yeah, we did. Well, what do you yeah. think? It's a unique ride, yeah. Isn't it? It's a unique ride, yeah. and that's not, not one of them around in the world. That's yeah. the only one, I think. Yeah, uh, but yeah, it's got a bit rough on it a bit yeah. in this season. Just a bit, but, yeah. just a bit. It's when you're coming into the station, yeah, it's isn't just it? That bit there, isn't it? More yeah. Than bit too, yeah. yeah, just a bit rough there. Yeah. But yeah, we've also got some new silver bits on the uh, second little hill bit here. I think that's the when uh, there's a breakdown on it, anything and we have to go up and evacuate or something. But yeah, that's really cool to see. But uh, yeah, it was really good to see chase. Yeah. It's a nice family coaster, isn't it? Where you get to race. The third lane hasn't been up for a while now. No. It wasn't open a lot last year, yeah. was it? Hopefully we can get that back running because yeah. Um, it gets quite busy steeple chase and it holds up a bit of a queue on it yeah. sometimes so there so were um, only just, six horses running on the track yeah only six so getting that third one back up and getting nine horses on the track um, just to make it the queue go down a bit more yeah, it, it, which will be really good and it will um, optimise queue times as well which will be really good yeah. so um, yeah anyway I think next going to uh, do some dark rides next yeah. that one get away from this horrible rain eh? yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah we'll see you um, on whatever dark, dark ride we're going on next yeah um, but yeah, I really enjoyed the people chase. Great fun the coaster. Well, the curse of opening day continues, doesn't it, Mum? Yeah. Two rides broken down next to each other. Avalanche here has got its shutters down, and I don't think that's going to open no. today, is it? And Revolution just there, they're just stuck on the top there, but we've got a ride operator with them, three? Yeah, three just, just three of them. Yeah, probably just telling them about the ride or something like. Um, it's just broken down or something because yeah, saw them coming down steps didn't we when um, we were filming the avalanche bit for you but yeah um, anyway next we're going to go on Wallace and Gromit next yeah. aren't we with Philobatic a riveting ride let's go see Wallace and Gromit eh mum yeah. Well, I think it's the busiest I've ever seen. Wallace and Gromit's thrill on that thing, isn't it? You, Mum? It changed it, haven't I? Have I'm they? Sure that used to be yeah, I think it did. I don't know, though, they might have. Yeah. yeah, I'm sure it used to be, and this was a speedy pass bit. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, we switched it around. The entrance used to be on that side, and the speedy pass on this side, but yeah. Just switched it around. At least we're not queuing right around there today. We just go over through this wall here and we're up there. But yeah, it's the busiest I've ever seen it, I think. Yeah. Don't you? Yeah, but yeah, like well, some grommets for a Lomatic. We'll see you when we get on it. And that, that nice dark ride to get away from this rain. Obviously, we're in a lot of rides open, isn't there? Yeah, more. Well, a lot of them are closed because of technical issues. Curse of opening day, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, um, we'll head on Wallace and Gromit though. I think that's why it's so busy, isn't it? Yeah. Because a lot of rides are open. Yeah. But obviously, we'll head on now for you on Wallace and Gromit's Thrillomatic, a riveting ride. 
So all this bit now is just extended queue line in it for Wallace and Gromit's thriller might hit mum. And it must just be quiet today because we've just got that rope across there. If it were really busy we'd just have that rope over there across there and then you'd have to walk through all that bit here. Yeah, speedy passes actually go all the way up in there now. But yeah, I don't think it'd be too long until we're on the Wallace and Gromit's thr thr thriller matic. It's a really good dark ride as with this as well. Can't wait to get back on it. Wallace and Rabbit's Thriller, Magic in the Rain, still haven't stopped, haven't it, has it Mum? But we've still got three more dark rides to do yet, yeah, haven't we? But what did you think of it? There were a strange smell in there, wasn't yeah, there? Yeah, there was a bit. Was, I think someone was cooking some or yeah. something. I don't know if it were coming from one of these or yeah. something. But yeah, it was, it, it, it was a bit of a strange smell in there, but it's still a really good it's ride. It's a well themed ride, that is it? Yeah, a bit of a queue for ghost train, but um, we're going to queue out where it's actually had a little bit of a repaint outside of it. If I just turn you around here, as you can see, they've just repainted all this bit up here with this bit here. So that's really good to see a bit of repainting being done to it. But yeah, I like the ghost train. It's a really good ghost train, this, isn't it, Mum? Yeah, One of the best ghost train yeah, driving yeah, this is, isn't it? But yeah, head on this ghost train now here, back to the Pleasure Beach. Gromit's, Wallace and Gromit's Rillomatic was really good though. I've just recognised as well, it used to have like skeleton spiders on it and yeah. stuff here, didn't it now? And now it's just um, a colour now. I don't know why they took them off. I enjoyed them being on there, but it still looks nice, a new colour bit to it, doesn't it? I like that little big thing there, what is yeah, it? Yeah, troll or troll. something. Yeah, here we go though. And I love this sign as well, outside at here, Ghost Train. And then, we'll see you after. Right then, so we just came off the ghost train. What did you think of that, Mum? I think that's one of the best ghost trains. Yeah. It's so well themed and I think that's even better than Honest Mansion at Disney. Yeah, obviously it's had a repaint outside. I think there's yeah. been a few changes inside as well. They were like a man with a shovel over there, weren't yeah. At the beginning of it, when he popped out with some strobes. Yeah. And then we were like a bit in there and it was like we were in the jungle or something. Yeah. And then like some people around and yeah. another like kind of... Um, like there, but theme's really good in there. Yeah. At the start down there, it's like a head that comes right to you, and it's like on a um, cart or something. It's really good. That's the I like is them like skeletons. Yeah, going that's a really good bit. I like that. I like the werewolf in there yeah. as well. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's amazing that ghost train. One of the best around. Yeah. The world's most haunted as well. You got can't forget that, but. Um, Obviously, 1930s. Yeah, 1930 it's been operating for and um, yeah, it's been really good on the day. Yeah. 930s when it opened as well. And it always builds up a queue when you come done it, but yeah. you never see it on the yeah. yeah. And um, yeah, it's really good ghost train that right? it's had a re-theme as well in there a bit, some new props and stuff, and a repaint outside of it a bit as well. But yeah, really enjoyed the ghost train. Anyway, now I'm gonna head on to River Caves because we've heard there's been some um, a lot of changes yeah. in the River Caves, haven't we? Well, yeah so far so we're gonna head on and um, see what it's all about really so um, yeah we'll see you over there at river case but the ghost train was really good yeah, was from home, like 20, 20 minutes. minutes or something yeah around 20 so yeah getting them trains out it's around 10 trains to 10 today in birth, so that's really good as well to know and we're getting them trains out really fast Right then, so we're just inside. This is all under covering the river caves in it, this bit of the queue line for it. But it's not too bad, it doesn't look, does it, Mum? No. We'll see what it's all about, this new theme, innit? Looking forward to it. Yeah. Yeah, it always comes and, uh, you know, bites us on the 
neck or something. Yeah. But um, yeah, we are going to head on Alice now. And um, yeah, but the rib case was really good, but no different thing than I saw in there. Did you know? But yeah, um, there we go. Saw some footage there of the Blackpool Pleasure Beach Fountain Show. Now we're heading on into Alice in Wonderland. Here we go. Looking forward to it, Mum. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna like this uh, ride. Yeah, it's a really nice ride. This you're going to Alice's Wonderland, don't you? On yeah. this, used to be loads of plants around on the wall on there, didn't they? And now they've all gone and stuff. Looks a lot nicer, done it now as well. I'll see you in. Updates here at Pleasure Beach for car doing that um, Chester or something's yeah. been painted, hasn't it? Mum at the bottom there. I don't know what you call them, <laughs> but yeah, it's been painted. It looks nice for that, doesn't it? Now and stuff. Yeah, it looks really nice. That it's a nice ride, Alice, as well. I like all these like track bits here where you go outside and go down and stuff. Obviously, because you go in and then you go up to levels and down levels and stuff on this, don't you, Mum? Like it goes up and then back down in the inside. But yeah, it's a really good ride, Alice. I really do like it, it's really nice. I think it looks a lot better without all the pants and stuff yeah. growing on the wall. So yeah, you can actually see the bits where they used to grow on just there and stuff at the bottom. Yeah, I think it's a lot better that now. Yeah, Alice in Wonderland, the ride. The Mad Hatter's Tea Party and Dr. Morgan Burns. We shall all wind down the rabbit hole together to visit my fabulous world of Alice in Wonderland. So step this way. <laughs> right, so we just come off Alice in, Wonder in Wonderland, the ride right here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. What did you think, Tom? Love that ride. The theme is so good and yeah. the been a lot of repaints, yeah, and repaints. new things going on. Oh, a bit smells in there, in yeah. there as well, but a lot of re repaints yeah. as well. It smells well. lovely in there, doesn't it? Yeah, it smells really nice yeah. in there, doesn't it, as well. And like a lot of um, a lot of like different like scenes. Yeah, um, but yeah, but a lot of different scenes as well with, um, in there. Wasn't if you well. come in here, it's well worth going on there. Yeah, a lot of repaints as well. Yeah. Um, Running well. Yeah, a lot of different texts around as well, yeah. wasn't there, Mum? Yeah, yeah, just like I said about levels going down, but levels went down and then we went back up. Yeah. It's heavily detailed yeah. in their theme. Yeah. All the dark rides here at Pleasure Beach, are Yeah, yeah. But yeah, the rain has stopped now. We've been yeah. on all the dark rides, so yeah, we're going to do some outdoor ones now. I think we're going to do flying machines next, yeah, aren't we, yeah. Mum? So yeah, we'll head on that for your next flying yeah. machines. But yeah, Alice in Wonderland, Wonderland was really good. Yeah. I really enjoyed it. Yeah. Right then, so we just come off uh, the flying machines. Uh, very cold that was on our faces, wasn't it? But just a wind blowing in our yeah. faces. It was really cold yeah. that. But yeah, uh, nothing done to the flying machines, I don't think. Do you? No. Mum? But yeah, they're still really nice. Yeah. Aren't they? A classic ride here at Pleasure Beach. On the roof of all these little shops. Yeah. 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 I don't think I've been talking today. Ice blast. I mean, ice blast, no. yeah. No, me, I'm talking about ice, ice jet ter Terence Reeves. Yeah, as you can see, there's not even no um, seats on it or anything. It looks like we're really doing some refurbishment to it there. Obviously, yeah, safety is paramount at theme parks and fairs as well. So, yeah, um, we can see why. Hopefully, we'll get on that one day because it looks good, doesn't it? Ice, ice blast. So, um, yeah, there we go. Anyway, now, I think we're going to go do the Derby Racer next, aren't we, Mum? So, yeah, looking forward to getting back on the Derby Racer and, um, yeah, see if there's anything done to this at all or anything as well. But, yeah. See you over at the Derby Race, so it's just located next door here. Just had a quick 
quick stop at the uh, cafe just up there underneath flying machines and next up going on Grand National next look at this so there's actually two tracks on Grand National here it's a wooder here at Pleasure Beach been around for a while this now as well you actually just race each other on this really it's a bit like steeplechase but you do your like your woodies and stuff as well got Andy from Coast to Crazy he's gonna be coming on with us hey got his latte <laughs> Yeah, hazelnut. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm looking forward to getting back on Steeple Chase. It's quite a good woody this as well here at Pleasure Beach. A bit rough, but yeah, really nice one. This is Grand National. So um, yeah, not Steeple Chase. Why did you say Steeple Chase? Then Grand National. Can't wait to get back on it. Here we go. We will see you after. Right then, so we just came off the Grand National there, and yeah, it was really smooth that, but it's not nice in rain, yeah. Andy, it's not nice in rain, that is it? Bloody awful, mate, yeah. <laughs> my face is, awful. Our face is absolutely burning. I know, it's from the really cold not and the nice. rain. My hood was just like this over, I couldn't see anything, mate, like hey, that. Hey, Lucas. Yeah. I'm on the telly now. You're on the telly. I tell you what, for a 13 year old, he's almost the same height as me. I know, look at this. In fact, look I think this. he is taller than me. <laughs> Yeah, I'm a bit taller than him, but yeah, it was really good Grand National. It was a bit smoother, in it? We yeah, non-wheel non seat in the middle. It was really smooth, that. Yeah. Probably one of the best balls. It's not the best ride I've had on it. No. But yeah. this rain is awful. You want to put your camera away, yeah, mate. Yeah, yeah. It's, really not very good. it's not very good for opening day, no. is it, really? No. But one yeah. of the worst opening days I've, I've ever but done, to yeah, be honest. Yeah, it's not the best curse of opening day, I'd say. Yeah. But yeah, we're going to head on Icon again, and I don't know, it might be the last ride for us today. An yeah. hour to go. Yeah, I've got an hour to go but yeah getting his money's worth but yeah weather's just horrible anyway i'm gonna put you away now so uh, yeah i'll just get a bit of footage for you of icon right then going on icon for the second time today here we go it might be the last i don't know but yeah i love this ride though mac rides it's amazing double launch coaster as well yeah here we go we'll head on icon for you now might be the last ride i get on icon today i don't know We'll have to see. I haven't even done the Big Dipper yet either. We'll have to do that after this probably as well, but I don't know. When we when we had a look through it, it was walk on Big Dipper nearly. Like, so hopefully we can get on that. Yeah, it's been a good opening day, though. But the weather has been uh, laid down a bit. Well, you know, you can, the weather can't help itself, can it? I come there to ride. I dare to ride. Let's head on. go there's icon been on it three times today we are that were absolutely amazing that i love icon so much yeah i don't know we might get one last ride on it before the park closes to get today but i don't know probably not but i don't know it's amazing icon though i absolutely love it it's really good i love icon yeah do back to back rides on it Obviously, you've got all the new Icon merch in the Icon shop as well. As you can see here, all the um, beach resort dressing gowns, fleece, blankets, stuff. There we go. It's all around Icon, all this stuff. Because it's obviously an Icon shop. Very nice, so yeah. Men backpacks are really nice. 15 quid. Obviously, if you do have a Pleasure Beach annual pass, you can also get discount off that. Icon like model kits here where you can build it the own like ride yourself out of metal I think. Ten pounds for them little pushies down there. Fleece throw. Yeah, it's a lovely shop in here as well. And the lights as well as like cherry blossoms or something is really nice as well. There we go, the icon. It's a really good ride, one of my favourites in the UK. Here we go then, here's the laughing man. We've been repainted, got new clothes, this bit's been repainted and everything. Looks really nice now. Founded in 1935. There we go. Don't spin around or anything anymore either. 
and his head doesn't move. But yeah, he is a very old the laughing man now, 1935. There we go. There he is. Well then, there we go. We just finished our Blackpool Pledge Beach opening day. Have you enjoyed it today? Um, I've had such an amazing day. It's been oh, lovely yeah, it's to been meet really people. Good today. Um, yeah, a lot of bookers here today. Yeah, and yeah. I went to guest services, and I've got um, another ticket for me and Lucas to come to be used by the end of the year. And we're over the moon, so it means we can come again. Yeah, now. I come as an Oh yeah, yeah. 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 It was strange about the weather, no. but you know, can't do anything about no, it. No, and yeah. that was part of it. It was part. Of the, the weather and there's also been a lot of rides down this today yeah. as well so that's that's why yeah. they've offered it as well. It was a bit busy at the beginning but it's yeah, yeah. quiet now yeah, hasn't absolutely. it so far. Everyone has spent a full day here today but yeah I'm glad we got a ticket to the yeah. again. Me too. It's been really good still in yeah. the rain. You still have fun at feed parks in the rain. you got yeah. to remember that. Yeah, yeah it was amazing. Yeah. Whoops, sorry. sorry. Uh, but yeah, that rides are good as well. Ghost Train's been good with uh, yeah. the uh, new uh, and yeah. stuff which I really enjoyed so uh, yeah there we go hope you did enjoy this while uh, not while we were attractions mayhem video and uh, yeah we'll see you on the next one see you, we'll see you later from Blackpool Pleasure Beach and also we didn't get on Valhalla today no yeah. it's too wet too wet yeah it's been torrential rain yeah but yeah hope you did enjoy it and we'll see you later bye